head down to Eugene now, where the new Hayward Field is truly an amazing spectacle. There are many features that catch your eye, especially the Hayward Field Tower, which pays tribute to some of Oregon's greatest athletes. Yeah, it's so beautiful. There's meaning to this, too. Our Travis Tyke joining us live from Hayward Field now. Travis, you spoke with one of the athletes whose image is actually on that tower. I did. I spoke with Raven Rogers. She was a six-time NCAA champion during her three years at Oregon. I'm going to step aside so you can maybe get a closer look at this tower. It is a 188-foot, six-inch tower, and it is front and center when you walk in to the main gates at Hayward Field. Now, being on the tower is an honor that Raven says she will treasure for a lifetime. Most of her family is just seeing the tower for the first time this week, including her grandma, who made the trip from her hometown of Houston to Eugene to see Raven race and witness her place in track town history. She's a very strong figure in our family. And to see her so excited um, and to know that it was worth it for me coming a while all the way out here and only coming home twice a year during college, it just makes it just really is a heartwarming, heartwarming feeling. Now you can see two of the five figures on the tower from this vantage point that we're currently standing at. And also on the tower on the other side, you have the iconic coach Bill Bowerman, the legendary runner Steve Prefontaine, Olympic gold medalist Otis Davis. And in addition to Raven on this side, you also have the two-time Olympic gold medalist in the decathlon, Ashton Eaton. Now as for Raven, she's already ran today in her semifinals in the women's 800 meter. She qualified for the finals, so she advances on. Those finals are Sunday at 4 o'clock. So, of course, we're going to keep tabs on her and her performance later on throughout the weekend. Reporting from Hayward Field, I'm Travis Tyke, Queen 6 News. Yeah, Travis and I heard one of the national sports people covering the Olympic trials down there saying Hayward Field absolutely took his breath away. He couldn't believe it. In an, an incredible improvement and in renovation to a part of Oregon's track history.